There's two things that I want to show you how to get uh, multi maps like the workshop, and I want to show you how to uh, use the collection Steam profile ID. Now let's go and have some fun. So we go into the web browser like this, and then go to um, uh, let me see uh, the type in ghost cap because we need some plugins. So what you have to do, just click on the first link, and then go to construct to a plugins list like that. Now what you have to do, scroll down and then type in uh, DAF, just like DAF. Now scroll a little bit down, there you can see workshop different map. Now as you can see in the description, there will say it, allow you to choose your own construct start workshop map. Now it's good, right? Now what you have to do is uh, click on the name and then click on the release tab like that. And now make sure you need to download the last patch. Just uh, download the zip. So now just go to your download folder like that. Now I want to remove the, the old map. Now uh, what you have to do is uh, right click and extract all in your download folder like this. Now this is the folder and this is the plugins. So what you have to do is uh, open up your Villacella and then um, go to download folder, construct shop and the plugins folder. Now what you have to do. You need to down, uh, extract the workshop different map right in the plugins folder, and there you go. And now it's uh, the time for the showing how to get a collection ID from your Steam profile. Now what you have to do is go to Google and then type in um, uh, count the strike uh, to a workshop uh, workshop map, uh, then uh, Steam. Then click on the first link. The, uh, you can uh, click on the link right in the description below. Now you are now here. What you have to do is go to browse and then go to collection tab like that. Now what you have to do if you are for the first time, then you need to create a collection like that. Then you need to type uh, give you collection a title for that you can remember from uh, like uh, which uh, collection is yours and then import the image like uh, for this video I want to import the p-hop icon from that now for the description uh, you can uh, type the description if you want just like uh, I going uh, use this for my community server just like that and then scroll down then uh, you can uh, they said uh, what kind of collection is this i'm using always a uh, item that work together now for the remember just try to remember which one do you want to uh, enable but i will enable the custom and of course i want to enable account like too just like that now what you do well, what you have to do uh, then you have to save and continue after you have done it then go to the next page and then type in again in the search bar on the google counter strike 2 workshop steam and then click on the first link and then click on the like uh, then go to the search bar and type in the map or uh, what you like if you like the p hope underscore then type in p hope underscore if you like the mg underscore then type uh, mg underscore so for me i want to use the mg underscore then click on search bar now for that, then you have to choose the map like uh, Ally Course. Now from the Ally Course, then you can see the add the uh, collection, then type it. Then click on this, and then I want to save on my United Force map collection, like that. Now press OK. Now there you go. Now what you have to do is go back to your uh, collection tab. So just like uh, browse and uh, collection. Now. After you create the own collection and you did enable like a uh, custom and of course uh, construct two, then you need to shot by most popular last update, and of course there you can see my name. There they said United Force Map Collection. Now click on that name. Now there's a lot of the maps that is with the walking as well. So now what you have to do is just uh, uh, open it. Uh, then you need to, uh, to copy your uh, collection ID like this. Just uh, remember that. Uh, right click on the number, copy, 
Now go to the next page and then go to tethost.net and click on the first link as well. And then go to the test pod and then go to edit. And now from that, go to the settings tab and scroll down. Then you have to change the map source into Steam Workshop collection. Now then type the ID from your uh, Steam profile like that and then click on save and reboot. Now for the make the uh, collection start map is working, we need to go to open up the Velocella. We need to go uh, sign in into your server FTP like this. Then go to add-ons, then go to construct shop, then go to plugins. And from here, you need to go to workshop default map. Now what you have to do, the, the, you can see the workshop default map dot text. Then right click and view edit. Now from that, you need to remove uh, the start map like this, like uh, the odd. Now just go back in your uh, workshop collection like this and then go uh, choose the map, what, what you like. I want to choose um, a coffee map like this and then copy this one, right click, copy the name, then go to here, then paste the name on this one, then go to file and save and click on FTP like uh, yes. And now you need to go back in your hosting panel like that host. Then go to the first link, then go to the dashboard, now from here go to edit, and then go to and uh, restarting your server like this. Now for the map choose plugins, I want to show you just uh, what you have to do is go to the Google, then type in ghost cap. And then click on the first link, write that. Now you have to go construct to a plugins list. And scroll down, then type in um, map choose. Now, by the map choose, just uh, get the construct to map choose and not the light map choose. I want to use the construct to map choose. Now, what you have to do, you need to go to the releasing tab, and by the release tab, and make sure you need to download the last patch. So, after you download the, the last patch, then you need to extract like inside uh, the download folder. Now from here, there's an add-ons. Now what you have to do is just uh, open up the Velocella and then go to sign in like so. And then you have to um, track the add-ons like this inside the root folder. There's not inside the add-ons, but just uh, in the root folder. And if you've done it, then you, you need to go to add-ons, construct shop, config, and of course, I mean, uh, plugins and the map choose. By the map choose, just uh, right click on the map exemplar, but for the map exemplar, I want to change it in, into the map dub X. So I want to remove the exemplar. So now from this, just right click and view. Now put the map name like the workshop uh, inside the map dub text, just like so. Uh, and how you do this, now what you have to do is just um, go to the construct uh, to a workshop and then go to the first link and after that then go to browse and go to uh, collection tab. Now by the collection tab just uh, enable the customize and of course uh, construct to that I did uh, create it. Now what you do is short by a uh, last update. Now just open up your uh, collection tab, like a night force map, and then go to the uh, toxic map, and then copy the name of the map, like this. So, and now what you have to do is, uh, I want to test the one, it's just a type way as, then paste the name, map name, and then click on file and save. So open the console and type in the chat, like the comment. Uh, we call it testing the uh, this is uh, the default map is working fine and now we call it uh, like here so now there's an other place right now and now we call it testing the nominate now I want to type uh, one wait seconds uh, oh wait already no no nominated okay I'm gonna go die. 
Okay, so now the map is now uh, like uh, it's going to, to change. So I want to take it number three. Okay, so now we need to uh, enable. Now we need to download the map. So I will just uh, press on allow. And it will be down on the map, so this is working now, I hope so. So the map is going to change, and there you go. We have now fixed the starting map from the, the collection, and of course the JC map from the map juice.